What's up guys? So what you just saw is my morning routine. My whole day is kind of determined by what happens at 6 a.m. Because at 6 a.m. that's when my garbage company goes to work. On a regular day, I might get a text like this that says I'm needed to come fill in. Normally, this would happen because somebody didn't show up to work. Today, I got this text. So I'm gonna be going in and doing recycling. If I hadn't got a text, I would normally spend a little bit of time drinking coffee while my family had breakfast and got ready to go to school. I try to leave my family off of most of my videos, especially my wife, because I just don't want people talking about my wife. Keep my wife's name out your mouth! Then I would go check on my scrap metal business. I've been spending a lot of time lately focusing on my scrap metal business because we haven't officially opened yet, even though we're bringing in some metal on the roll-offs, I have to get this thing open. We're really struggling right now to get software in place because there's a lot of regulatory stuff that has to be done. We invested in some software that makes it kind of cookie cutter and very easy to handle the regulatory piece and we're just trying to get that done. But right now, I'm gonna go do this recycling and then I'll see you after that. So recycling is done. I'm gonna head to my office, try to get some work done. See you in a minute. So I'm here in my office. It's a little bit after lunch. I just had a quick lunch and uh, normally I check things out in the morning and um, like I have this big cleanup that I've been working on a lot and uh, or I'll go check my scrapyard but then in the afternoons I try to come to the office and spend some time just it just depends sometimes I'm kind of just working on like menial tasks and sometimes um, I'll be working on like a special project but for the most part um, it's all really like high level CEO stuff that's probably way over your head. And if I try to explain it, it would just be too complex for you to comprehend what I'm doing on a day-to-day -day basis. Beep, 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 beep. I'm kidding. Um, some days I just hang out in my office and think. Um, it just depends. Jeff Bezos, uh, I'll steal his quote, but he said it best. It's a CEO's job to make a few high quality decisions. And I think that's really important if you get to the point where you can have people working under you and you've grown your businesses that you spend a lot of your time just working on the strategy and what's next. An example of this would be like, let's say I wanted to open a second location at one of my businesses. Well, this could, increase the value of my business, it could increase how much profit I'm making, or it could bankrupt us, right? So I might make a few decisions, but they're really high quality decisions. Um, one of my subscribers, his name's Alex, just sent these to me. I just opened them, haven't had a chance to look at them, but these are pretty cool. Um, these are little roll off keychains and uh, he made them I think on a 3d printer and he sells them so um, 
he sent me some just to uh, kind of check them out and see if I wanted to buy some. You can get them in different sizes, whatever. I'll put a link in the description if you like them. You can order a few and uh, I think you just email them and tell them what you want. But anyway, um, on a normal day, I might work on a lot of like little menial tasks. Like when we were trying to get our scrap business going, I spent a lot of times just reading and trying to get in place procedures for all the regulatory stuff. There's a ton of regulatory stuff you have to do to take in scrap metal just because there's a lot of theft in that business and you don't want to buy stolen goods. If you do buy stolen goods, you want to have a good paper trail so that the authorities, you can help them find who stole it and all that stuff, right? Um, so other days I might just kind of sit around thinking about the strategy um, or just pondering different things, right? Like different things to bring value to my life or my, to my company. Um, I usually stay here till about 3.30 or 4.00. And then I go to the gym. I have a pretty awesome gym set up at my house. And a lot of days I just go home and work out. Um, I feel like I get a better workout when I actually go to the gym though, because kind of the atmosphere is like everybody's working out and like you kind of push yourself a little bit harder. And uh, after that, I go home. I usually get home between five and 5.30 every day, have dinner with the family. And a lot of days I take my kids swimming. We do a tremendous amount of swimming. Even in December when it's cold, doesn't matter. We swim all the time. And um, I work on my YouTube videos at night. I usually spend an hour or two a day working on YouTube. Just kind of depends on what kind of video I'm working on. But um, put like maybe five or 10 hours a week into that. And anyway, about nine o'clock I go to bed and that's kind of my whole day right there. I get ready to start over the next day. So hope you enjoyed the video. This is a day in my life. Um, these days change. So maybe in a few months, I'll do another one and just kind of give an idea of what my schedule looks like then. But I'm going to put another video up right here and I'll see you soon in the next one.